What's going on people? It's Aaron Cantu from The Boxing Voice. Disappointing news in the world of boxing as the much anticipated mega fight between Deontay Wilder and Anthony Joshua will most likely not take place in 2018. All reports indicate that Anthony Joshua and Matchroom Boxing have elected to exercise their mandatory fight against WBA challenger Alexander Povetkin. Just yesterday, Matchroom Boxing's Eddie Hearn posted this photo on Instagram showing Joshua meeting with Alexander Povetkin's team and negotiating a fight that may take place in late September. This is a huge blow for boxing considering there's been a lot of hype around this fight. It's almost to a point where people and fans are getting irritated with the fact that this fight has not been made. Why all of a sudden has the WBA decided to mandate this fight at the heels of negotiating an undisputed unification fight. We all know, people, the fans, everybody knows undisputed unification fights trump any type of mandatory negotiation, which may lead fans to believe that Eddie Hearn and Matchroom have been in collaboration with the WBA, considering that the WBA failed to mandate a fight between Anthony Joshua and Luis Ortiz right before the Joshua Klitschko fight took place. What do the fans think? What do the people think? This has been a crazy negotiation saga that we've seen and here's the facts. Anthony Joshua sent out a $12.5 million flat fee offer to Deontay Wilder to fight in the UK. Deontay Wilder raised his bet and guaranteed him $50 million to fight in the United States, which would have been the highest guaranteed purse ever in heavyweight championship history. This presents the question, is this the biggest heavyweight duck in boxing history? You be the judge. Where you at, Anthony Joshua? Anthony Joshua called everybody name but my name. For The Boxing Voice, I'm Aaron Cantu. Make sure to tune in next time for Cantu's Corner. Stay Cantu'd.